What's going on YouTube? It's Mike here. Today guys in this video, I'm going to be talking about iOS 9 beta 4. So today, July 21st, Tuesday, 2015, Apple went ahead and released iOS 9 beta 4 for all iDevices running iOS 9 beta. So this is the fourth beta build and I'm running it here on my iPhone 6 Plus. Um, and I gotta say, so far it's pretty stable. What I've seen so far is there's not a lot of new features, um, but what we can see from this is there's quite a few bug fixes as well as some fixes that Apple was due to bring, um, especially one of the big ones being home sharing coming back, which is pulled in iOS 8.4 with the launch of Apple Music. That's now back and present in iOS 9 beta 4. Additionally, in the new app switcher, a uh, handoff has been improved and it looks a little bit different. It's now down on the bottom of the actual screen itself versus being another card uh, in the app carousel in the actual app switcher, which was kind of bugging me, so I'm happy to see that. And there's quite a few different fixes here and there and improvements, not a lot of stuff going on. Like this new notifications icon uh, here is now red. Um, so I guess that's kind of cool to see that's something that they pointed out. Um, the battery icon down here, which is, was a new tab in iOS 9, um, that icon was squared. It was weird, it was squared between everyone else. Um, in the previous beta now it's fixed in this one but so you could see as you could see from telling from that there's just not a lot of improvements all around um, besides the fact that there are probably a lot of bug fixes which is still great bug fixes are the best and it's making it a much more stable release uh, come its final release and if you want to grab this update uh, if you're already on iOS 9 go settings general software update and it'll be right here if you're on iOS 9 if you're not registered and you're on you know you're on iOS 8 or whatever version you may on and you're looking to upgrade you're going to want to make sure your device is registered with UDIDregistrations.com. As always, I'll leave their link down in the description below. Prices actually went down. It's actually now only $3.99 um, to register your iDevice. And if you want to go with one of the more expensive packages, you could use the code WWDC2015 to get 10% off your order. So I'll leave all that good stuff down in the description below so you can go check it out. You can get your device registered and up and running iOS 9 in no time. And I'll also leave the link down there to follow my tutorial if you're not exactly sure how to get iOS 9 on your device. There's a tutorial in a link in the description, which is another video it'll take you to it's my video and it'll show you exactly how you could get ios 9 running on your device but that's it for this one guys that is ios 9 beta 4 if you want to check it out like i said all the links down in the description are below as well if you're wondering apple also released watch os 2 beta 4 as well as os 10 l capitan beta 4 i'm actually running that on my mac right now i'm yet to update my watch but for those of you who are wondering um those are out as well so go grab them but thank you guys for watching this video if you liked it please leave some comments below on your thoughts of course rate give this video a thumbs up and click the subscribe button below be sure to also follow me on twitter at mike's ios help i'll be keeping you updated there and also be sure to follow me on periscope at mike cronin uh, if you haven't already do broadcast there so go check it out that's it for this video guys and i'll see you in the next one